Hi, my name is Vanchika and my hobby is painting. I like coding and my favorite language is C++. Hey there job seekers and welcome back to our channel and today we are diving into one of the most crucial aspects of landing your dream job that is standing out in your interview. How to stand out in front of your interviewer is very important. Usse tumhari job mein bahut zyada effect ho sakta hai. So before you even step into an interview room, take some time to understand yourself better. Think about your strength, your weaknesses, experiences, achievements and be ready to talk about your professional journey in front of your interviewer, your passion and how they align with the company's value and goals. So whether you are a professional or a recent graduate, you should master the art of first impression is the last impression. So keeping all these things in the mind, let's get started with our video today. Hi, welcome to the interview. So tell me about yourself. Hi, my name is Vanchika and my hobby is painting. I like coding and my favorite language is C++. Personalize your response. Tell your answer to showcase how your skills and experience aligns with the specific requirements of the job and the company's culture. Highlighting unique aspects of your background and achievement can make you memorable to the interviewer. Hi, my name is Vanchika and I'm recently graduated from University X with a bachelor's of technology degree in IT. During my time in my university, I was really interested in exploring all the opportunities and I really love to explore things. In addition to my academic pursuits, I actively participated in XYZ club where I contributed to organizing numerous events, workshop, honoring my team and leadership skills. Now that I've finished my degree, I am excited to work on a job where I can see what I know to help out others. I want to tackle real life problems and make a difference. Thank you so much for considering me and that's all about myself. I can't wait to join the team and be a part of its success. Great one, Chika. Thank you so much. Can you give me an example of the time when you faced a challenge at work and how you overcame it? I don't know how to answer this, but I think that um, the situation, uh, I whenever I had a situation, I have dealt with it in a very good way. The STAR method, situation, task, action, result is the secret weapon. Use it to structure your response to behavioral questions by providing specific examples and highlighting your problem solving skills. You will demonstrate your value to the employer. So the situation I'll talk about is that we need to improve our mobile app performance due to the growing user base I had faced in my previous organization. So as a task, what I did is as a tech lead, I led optimization efforts for a seamless user experience. And as a part of action, I analyzed performance, optimized functions and implemented cache mechanism. The result was app load time decreased by 40% boosting the user satisfaction and retention. This showcased my leadership and technical skills in a diving tangible improvements. The power of research. What do you know about our company? Can you let us know a little bit? Yeah, actually I'm new here, so I don't know much about the company, but I will definitely go and research about it. Research is the key to impress your interviewer. Deep dive into company's website, social media, channels, recent news, everything. Follow company. What company is doing? What are the latest news? By showcasing your knowledge and enthusiasm, you will prove that you are perfect for the, for the role. Interview will be like, okay, this person is generally interested in the company. I have researched extensively and admire how your company prioritizes innovation in sustainable technology solutions. Your commitment to reducing environmental impact through cutting edge initiative aligns perfectly with the value and expertise in software development for positive impact. What are your strengths and weaknesses? I think my strength is I'm really very good in coding and uh, painting and for the weakness I am not sure I don't think so as of now I have any weakness. So during the tech interview when they ask about what you are good at and what you are not so at that time it is really important to show that you yourself humble and you are always ready to improve. Talking about my strength so I am really good at solving tough problems for example uh, once I led a team to fix a bug issue in a project and making sure everything works smoothly. So I really admire that uh, about myself. So this is one of my strengths and talking about my weakness. So I sometimes struggle with managing my time, but I am working on it. So uh, using the new technologies and asking for advice, I am trying to improve it. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tips and tricks. Until next time, goodbye, good luck out there.